this is Pandora and welcome to the Digworks. Today I'll be playing The Sims 2 and I am using the double deluxe and pet discs. This means I have celebration, some nightlife and pets to experiment with. And what I'll be doing in this series is the poverty challenge, if anyone's heard of that before. I remember the creating this town. So many memories. I created it last year as I was supposed to do this last year, but people get busy. Looks like I use this town for my own entertainment as well, seeing as though I have two families that fit their name purpose. I'm not sure if Fraps is recording right now. Oh wait, yep, it is. I've realised I'm recording it into the wrong file completely. Oh well. I can always change that when I'm done. Great. It's crashed my game. Back in a minute, guys. And we are back. I apologise if you can hear any background noises. I have my window open and my door open, so if you hear any music, children, lawnmowers or people walking about and slamming doors, that is why. It is warmer inside than it is out, so I do feel like I'm slightly dying. Plus I have a hot lot uh, sorry, I have a hot laptop on me as well. Right, let's get started. Time to make a sim. Obviously I'm going to make me. I look nothing like this but I want to make it quick. Now there are some steps to take and some rules to abide by for this challenge. Step 1. Create a sim. Done that. Step 2. Move your sim into the largest lot. It says here 5 times 5 but I do have a bigger lot to that about. I think that's from the expansion packs but I'll stick to what it says here. Um, step 3. Start off with a hoe. Start off with 100 simoleons, or simoleons, I don't know how you pronounce that. Um, they've given me some options on how to go about this. Spending it all on floor tiles and terrain purchases, I think I'll stick with tiles as it's easier for me to mine this money. It says here that you can use Netless Family Funds cheap. But I've never heard of this, so I think I'll leave this out. I haven't played this in ages. This is going to be fun. I'm sorry about the quality, guys, but I have to have it on quite low so it can run on my computer, so you're gonna have to just deal with it. Time to buy lots of tiles.
Right, now I'm down to 100, I can begin the challenge. So I start with 100 simoleons, and the challenge doesn't end until the grandchild of the original sim dies of old age. I can see this being a very lengthy series. I suppose it can be cut short if my sim dies of hunger because we're so poor. I can get a job but I have to stick with level 1. If I get any higher then I'll have to quit immediately and start a different job and advancing in careers can cause me to lose points. There's a point system. So I'll see at the end what score I have. Looks like I'm going to have to keep track somehow. All the children I have must have the money aspiration but grandchildren may have any. Only NPCs and services may join the family, so that's random neighbours I didn't create and workers like the police and maids, I think. I guess it must be. Looks like I won't start work until tomorrow. Yay! Random as I can make babies with. Now you talk to her. Right. Greet him and tell him that you love him. I'm so glad I can fast forward in this game, otherwise I think it would be quite boring. And there's a dog playing in my way. Lovely. The sim is really hungry. This is annoying. I can't afford a fridge for food, so she's going to die. I know, pizza. Thank God I can afford some things. I think hunger is the most important thing to keep an eye on at the moment, as I'm not too interested in having a dead sim on my lot. Do people bring food at pies? Or is that only in Sims 3? I think it's only Sims 3. I'll try and get the pizza person to give me free food. I've done it before, so I'm sure I can do it again. I guess I could get fed outside at a friend's house, but I don't know how to do that. Anything. 
okay right I'm gonna have to end it here guys but thank you very much for watching it's the Sims 2 doing the poverty challenge my name is Pandora and this is the Digworks see you on the next episode